So, do you need something to help you draw? Do you spend your time drawing all day just to rip it up because your drawing sucks? Well, I'm here to change that. Help you with that anyway. Gammon S620 may help you a lot. It's 8192 levels and battery free. There, there it's, it's. This is how I draw using fingers and this is how I draw using Gammon S620. There's a big difference and I drew those using phone. Using my phone by the way. Now, let's get to it. Before we continue the video, I just want to warn you that the video's quality may be bad because I'm not good at using cameras. So, this, this is the, ta the tablet and there's... I don't know what these are, but let's just check that later. That's the manual. There's the pen. So you should remember to draw the anatomy first and foremost. It's one of the most important steps to draw the base later on. Set this as an example. To make the proportions look uh, correct, I think, drawing the anatomy first is recommended. I actually had a hard time doing this, but afterwards I got used to it, and it's actually really good, even at phone. Next is the sketch. In this part, you can go crazy and draw whatever you want. You can scribble or whatever. <laughs> after that, it's the linear art that comes after. Now in this part, it is important to be confident with your lines and strokes. Giving too much effort for one step is not really necessary. For me, in all an honesty, I want to finish fast rather than focus on certain steps. That see this in a, as an example. As you can see, the one on the other side is way too time consuming, while on the other hand, it's rather fast and confident. That's because on the time consuming one, some artists tend to follow the sketches line, so we tend to redo it if the stroke strays from the straight lines for a bit, while on the other one, the strokes are confident. So this has four programmable hotkeys to know um, how wide the area you want to occupy. For the mobile phone workspace, make sure to press the, the first and the third hotkeys. The active area is 6.5 width and 4 inch long. There is also a USB plug on the side to plug your plug the cable that will go along with the whole package. Also, Gammon S620 is light and easy to car carry around, whether it be at the mall or the supermarket, wherever you want to take it. It's also compatible with gaming and ideal for web conference and online learning. Overall, Gaumon S620 is a very good tablet and I suggest you buy it. So what are you waiting for? Click the link in the description below and add it to cart.